Why did I have to rot from the butt first? I thought. I was one of the only packages of meat left untouched in the now not working freezer. Whoa, wait. What is this? I asked out loud startled. I heard a piercing sound through the, the cellophane of my wrapping. Come with me, if you want to fucking live. A rugged voice called out to me. I watched in horror as I removed a samurai sword from his back and he cut my rotted flesh off my butt. He was a gorgeous strawberry. He had a 5 o'clock shadow at 3.30 a.m. The man was the man. I was a little jealous. For as long as I could remember I was just a fat lump of flesh. I laid on display naked all day every day for the world to see. I felt like I never had much to offer. I was fatty. A lower quality of mystery meat. You coming? I need to get to the seed vault in the Arctic. We don't have long before we rot also. The strawberry grabbed me by a strand of flesh and pulled me out of my package. I felt wanted for the first time in my existence. His touch was soft as he grabbed me so sensually. I couldn't help it. I left a little juice behind in the package. What is the seed vault in the Arctic? I asked. He was scanning the area too busy to reply. I joined in and noticed that there was an ocean of fruit juices on the floor. What must have been 10 gallons of tropical fruit blend had been cut open and was now staining the tiled floor. A loud roar came from behind a corner and a loud wet slapping could be heard moving along the linoleum floor. The fluorescent lighting of the grocery store were flickering off and on in slow intervals. They're coming. I heard the man say. He pulled his sword in front of him. He looked like a sexy samurai warrior. His long gorgeous stem was so thick and strong. A burst of movement exploded out from behind a counter and a blob of flesh was rolling towards us. It was filled with meat of all kinds formed into a single mass of wriggling rotting flesh. It moaned as it reached out for us. The wet slaps as pounds of meat hit the floor. The strawberry took a deep breath and rushed at the mass. In one quick flick of his seed. The mass was cut in two. Wow. Incredible. Clean up on aisle 7 a am I right? I laughed at my own joke. That is not fucking funny. The man replied. And. That is how I ended up here. I told the cashier of light in the great grocery store in the sky.